that be a lesson to you? Two boys, ten and eleven, handed into police by their furious mother, after she caught them vandalizing forty graves in a cemetery. A cemetery in South Australia's rural Riverland district was vandalized by a group of young children last week. The mother of two of the vandals, aged 10 and 11, has since handed her sons into the council in order to make them pay for their actions. Headstones and grave sites at Barry Cemetery were smashed and torn apart by the two brothers and a third boy, aged 9, on December 6. Dave Otto de Grancy, from Barry Barmer Council said he was furious when he saw the extent of the damage to more than 40 graves. Mr. Otto de Grancy later received a call from the boy's mother, who he said was devastated by her son's actions and wanted them to pay their dues. I explained to the boys the meaning of a headstone and that each headstone tells its own story, I explained to them that a grave is a very sacred site for each person, Mr. Otto de Grancy told the Adelaide Advertiser. The council worker said the children were remorseful for their actions and became emotional when they realized the damage they caused. After a while, the lads really broke down and I drummed into them how much they'd hurt their mum and nana, he said. They gave them a kiss and cuddle and apologized. Mr. Otto de Grancy said he took the boys through the cemetery and had them apologize to the graves they damaged. After walking through the cemetery, one of the boys is believed to have said I just wish I could take all this back and say sorry to all the people. The pair were suspended from their primary school and will spend the week weeding the cemetery. Mr. Otto de Grancy intends to meet with the third boy who vandalized the cemetery to confront him about the damage. A GoFundMe page has been set up by a community member who had her partner's gravesite vandalized by the boys. The fundraiser hopes to raise $10,000 to pay for the damage to headstones and the cemetery.